Hello everybody, I'm going to do a quick review slash demonstration on these Mac Tools automatic wire strippers. This is item number WSC200B. Uh, this is in about, I don't know, 25 years or so, 20-25 years. This is the only tool that I've ever had that I lost. And I tried to replace it with other auto strippers along the way and they just didn't hold a candle to this one. I really like this and I'm going to show how it works. Now this actually cost me in total $53.55 ordering from Mac. At the time I purchased them they were $37.99. Now they're $39.99. But the shipping they kind of gouged me on that for almost $12 bucks, and then of course I had almost $4 in tax. But I had seen them on, I was looking to try to find the model number online and I found a link to Amazon that has a GB brand and I swear they're the exact same stripper and they're $22.99 from Amazon with $6.59 shipping. I'm going to add that in my description if you guys wanted to compare the two. I'll put both links in there. Uh, but I, I believe they're the same tool. But I'm going to show you how they work. These things are actually, they're awesome. They're great. Uh, it's got a few functions on it. It's got a wire cutter here. I never really use these because you have to, if you're up in a wire harness under a car or something, you got to fish them through. They're kind of difficult to use, but they work. Cut your wire off. There's some crimpers here for insulated crimpers, uh, butt connectors, uh, non-insulated, a couple sizes. I never really use these either because you've got to really hammer on them because it's on the back side. There's not much leverage you get there. But they will uh, strip between, it looks like, 24 gauge all the way down to 10. You know, so that's a pretty big wire on 10. But let me just show you how they work, man. They're just, they're awesome. Just stick your wire in there how much you want. And there you go. It's stripped. It's ready to go. Super quick. So you can put your butt connector on or whatnot. I don't like using scotch lock connectors, you know, where you would pierce down in the middle of the wire. I can't stand those things because they always fail at some point in time. It may be okay for a car stereo or something like that, but nothing important. But what you can do with these, which is also pretty cool, if you wanted to say, let's say you wanted to do a solder joint right in here, you could actually strip it within the shield and split the wire right open right there so these are really really good like I said this is the only tool I've ever lost and uh, it bugged me for years until I finally purchased one so if you guys are looking for a good auto stripper uh, this is the one I would recommend thanks for watching and good luck